Well, good evening, folks. T tonight's challenge is uh, sent to me by a young lady in Clovis named Caitlin. So, uh, let me show you what she picked. Lavender Frost. Metallic pink. Black. And green glitter. Folks, uh, I have about 10 minutes to figure out what I was going to do with this, so tune in and let's see what I can get done. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hit this baby with pink. The whole lure is going to be turned metallic pink. Let me get my reducer. Reduce that paint down. I had an idea going through my head about what I was going to do, so my boss sitting over there running the camera told me I needed to do something. So I guess I'm going to do something, folks. So you know what, folks? I've been really enjoying these these challenges like this. Uh, Makes me think, have to think outside the box a little bit. It's a lot of fun to do, so if you got something you want to see me paint, just uh, drop a comment. Leave it to me. Give me the colors you want to see. And if I have them colors, you'll see it. May not be what you expect because, you know, I'm kind of a redneck and we kind of got our own ideals about a lot of things. So let's make this little metallic paint. Thin coats. Then we'll dry them and come back and hit another coat. This is a deep diver, folks. This thing will go 8 to 12 feet underwater. It's a round bill bait. It's not a square bill. Dry it dude down a little bit and let's get us a, another coat on it because I really want to darken this lure up good. So I can get the effect that I'm uh, looking for. That's pink. Pink is pretty. Okay, folks, let's go ahead and pop a third coat on that just for, for giggles. I ain't going to say that other word that goes along with that. But just for giggles, let's go ahead and put a third coat. Dump it out. Clean our brush out. Miss Kate, she surprised me with these colors. I really wasn't expecting these colors, so. But it'll look nice. You just have to check out what I'm going to do to it. I think you'll be utterly surprised yourself. Now, folks, this young lady that sent these colors to me, she is an artist. Uh, I hope I don't let her down. I'm an old fogey. So I'm going to do my best to make this lure different than anything that she's ever seen. And maybe she'll be happy and won't beat me up or anything. So let's get on to the next step. Okay, folks, we got our pretty pink all dry here. So I'm going to fool everybody. I have some of this. Don't ask me the name of it. All I know is it's it buy it at Hobby Lobby. So we're going to wrap this bait with this fun stuff right here. Get her all wrapped up and looking pretty. I think I want to wrap from this way in. Good tie wrap. 
there. I'm get my old ugly scissors out. Try to trim that up on there a little bit. Just like that. And just keep on the, trying to pull this down tight and pull it together really good. And just see what we can come up with for this. Okay, we got her wrapped up and pretty flat there. So the next color that we're going to run on this bait is Lavender Frost. And it is purple. Purple, 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 purple. What I do with my little stick. There's my little stick. So, let's get our little air gun over here, pour us up some of that there lavender. Set that and we'll just be, keep putting multiple coats on it. Well, that is light. Let's see what we got here. We may be completely unhappy with the results here. Well, that's going to be an interesting bait, folks. Very interesting. I think it'll look just fine. So, now, black. Folks, what are we going to do with black paint? We're not going to do nothing until we clean our gun. Okay, this ain't going to have black two ways on it. Just a tiny bit in there. That's all we're going to need here. So folks, let me know what y'all think about a husband and wife challenge. Y'all pick the colors. She paints against me. She keeps telling me she's better. 
So, I want to know how y'all feel about having a husband and wife challenge. If she's really nice to me, folks, I'll even let her use my airbrush. Well, she's got to be nice. And give this thing a little old face like a little old coon. Here's what I'm doing. Don't laugh, folks. You'll like it when it's finished. So now, we're going to dump out what little bit of black paint we got there. Just gonna speckle this thing up a little bit. Not a whole lot, just a, a little bit. Let's get right down here on this old belly and get him speckled too. So, folks, for that challenge, that's kind of what I come up with. Them some funky colors. Find some eyes to put on him here. So, na, 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 na. Batman. We're gonna put some black eyes on him. Black people, silver eye. There he is. Weird bait, folks. Weird bait. So you all know the next step. <clears throat> Got to take the tape off the bill. Now we'll throw some proxy on him. See what we get. Now folks, for this one we're going to do one and one. One cc and one cc. We're going to clear one of the hardener. Let's 
still on down there. green glitter. Give her a good mix. Well, that is most certainly something different. I wish the purple would have been darker, but it is what it is, and we did what we set out to do, and it was a challenge, so there's our challenge bait. We're going to hang it over here to dry and then we'll pull it off after it gets dry and see what it really looks like once it is dry and it'll actually lighten up as it dries some. So there we are folks. One of the weirdest lures I've ever painted in my life. It's kind of cool. It really is. Hey folks, challenge number three. Miss Caitlin, she picked the colors for us. And what she picked was black. This is a Createx Transparent Flamingo Pink and Lavender Frost. This one was a little bit of a challenge in green glitter. So folks, come out of the mind of a redneck, this is what we come up with. And to be honest with you, I'd fish it. Uh, it's very unique, and it's very different, and uh, I hope that young lady's happy with it, because she's going to get it. It was a lot of fun to figure out what to do with this. And I call it the pink raccoon. So that's kind of what it looks like to me as a raccoon. Let me get my finger down here and get hooked up. So, cool bait. Hope the young lady's happy with it. Y'all have a great night and I'll catch you later. <laughs>